North Korea launched a ballistic missile over Japan as Tokyo urges residents to evacuate. North Korea has launched a suspected medium-range ballistic missile over northern Japan. This prompted warnings from the Japanese government that people on the island of Hokkaido should take shelter during the flights and the temporary suspension of some train operations. This is the first North Korean missile launch in Japan since 2017. The United Nations has banned North Korea from conducting ballistic and nuclear tests. Officials said the missile fell into the Pacific Ocean about 3000 kilometers from Japan and there were no reports of injuries. Japan Prime Minister Fumio Kishida strongly condemned the move describing the launch as violent behavior and the Japanese government conveyed a National Security Council meeting. The launch appeared to be a deliberate escalation to attract the attention of Japan and the US which have largely ignored North Korea leader Kim Jong-un. Flying a missile over or over another country is completely against international norms without warning or prior consultation. Most countries avoid it altogether as it can easily be mistaken for an attack and while it's not as big as a nuclear test, which could be the next, it's still very provocative. The US responded with the top US diplomat for East Asia, Daniel Krittenbrink, calling North Korea's decision regrettable. It comes after Japan, the US and South Korea held a trilateral military exercise that was known to provoke Yongyang earlier last week. The rocket launch was Yongyang's fifth in a week. On Saturday, two missiles landed in waters outside Japan's exclusive economic zone. Many of North Korea's missile tests have been carried out at the high, high trajectories reaching high altitudes and avoiding flights over their neighbors. But firing over or over Japan has allowed North Korean scientists to test the missile in circumstances that are more representative of the conditions they would encounter in actual use, analyst Ankit Panda told. Earlier this month, North Korea passed a law declaring itself a nuclear armed state with leader Kim Jong-un bearing denuclearization talks. Yongyang carried out six nuclear tests between 2006 and 2017 despite widespread sanctions. Thanks.